these are the uh, springs uh, that I'm going to put inside here. Or sorry, the spring is only one. Um, uh, I don't think this 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 is enough. This is about three millimeters. So I'm going to take a little bit deeper cut here. Let's see where we where we are now. So five point three. Well, I think this this could be good. Shouldn't this work? Sorry, it's about this deep. I think this should work. It's enough. That's enough. Um, so. What next? Um, I probably should mark where I should part this off. I was talking about 20. Let's measure this again. How deep is this? This is about 20, so it should be 22, 23, something like this. Um, that's going to be pretty, pretty close to the to the shock. So this isn't the best thing to do, but ah, I had to. So I have to. Now this is, of course, a little bit tricky here. So we have to spin it and see what happens. Yeah. It's good enough. This is not high precision thing, so uh, it should be working. So, um, and measure like maybe. Oh, so let's see here. Uh, I'm starting to make some. I think the bozo is is back actually, but I mean I mean this shouldn't be twenty. If I make this twenty, it will bottom out, and I don't want that. So I want this to be a little bit less, maybe fifteen. And fifteen is I bored more than fifteen here. So bozo is back actually, um, but that doesn't matter because I can cut it off here of course but um, how how to do this um, maybe I should cut this off about here but well, I have to think well I'm back after thinking like two seconds and I continue like this and see what happens. Otherwise, I just make a new one. So, uh, let's make a mark for the cut off. Maybe I should grind this a little bit. Should I? Again, it's not high position. This is just playing around.
that was that caliber. Ah, it's a sheep shines one anyway, so. Ah, that crap is showing inch again. I hate inch. Ah, it seems like it died this time. Finally, in that case. I never like it anyway. Hmm. It died. Strange. It died. Or maybe it's the battery. I don't know. I don't think so. So, I'm back. Huh, working. Piece of junk, just uh, had to get some smack, and uh, yeah, then it worked again. Ha, <laughs> um, I'm great at fixing things. Okay, if it doesn't work with uh, something else, it always works with uh, violence. Yeah. And it's, uh, in this case, actually, it worked. Usually it doesn't, but okay. Uh, so, we have this piece. Um, and we have this piece, and we have this spring, and let's test, let's, let's test fit, fit this. Hmm, worked, worked as expected, actually. So, th this is perfect. So, what do we have left? Um, uh, there was something I didn't do. I should have, uh, actually threaded this when I had it in. Doesn't matter, because... It's not high position. This, this is not high position. This is easy. So, um, the first thing to do, I think, also I have to polish this a little bit. Or I think so, at least. And um, what to do first? In this case, we have to counterbore a little bit also. So, let's take this one and hope we doesn't, we don't destroy the surface here. So. Doesn't matter. Ah, uh, it doesn't matter. Okay. Two. Um. Yeah, let's roll. I think uh, the most important thing was already done so what I did was that I bored this out I uh, turned this down to proper size and pressed it in and I, then I counterbored it for the little uh, screw that I'm gonna put in here like like so so that's pretty much it so let's see how it oh how it went out so yeah. perfect this is exactly how I imagine it so let's see if we have some decent or Height here, 42.5. Maybe I should try.
try to loosen it up a little bit. Forty forty three. So now I have forty three. And then when I have uh, when I set my tool, I'm gonna have a a small um, a drill hole here and attach something that I can attach a cable to. So I'm gonna have a cable to this one. Now I have plastic bottom, so it's insulated to to the machine. And yeah, perfect. Now the mill is going to not look like this ah. it wasn't because of that but anyway it can look like this nice yeah so um, next time you see this you will see it in action and I'm going to show it how I use it on the on the mill. So that's all for today. Uh, thank you for watching, and please comment and subscribe if you want to.